Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Breakfast Television. Now for some health. Taking vitamin supplements is an easy way to top up your diet. But as our health specialist, Leah Sarich, found out, you can get too much of a good thing. Jennifer Foley takes a multivitamin every day. I usually take a multivitamin for women yeah. um, so that it has the calcium and all that stuff in it just because my diet's not always as good as it should be. And registered dietitian Andrea Hallwegner says that's a good idea. Um, a basic multivitamin appropriate for your age will just give that extra little add-on each day to make sure you're getting what you need. But Hallwegner wants to stress food is still the best way to get your nutrition. Bring that a supplement is just a supplement and it's never going to replace eating balanced foods. However, Holwigner says about 50% of people are still not getting enough calcium. That could increase your risk of osteoporosis. It could also increase your blood pressure with age, and it could also put your risk for colon cancer. Vitamin D is another one worth taking that will help you absorb that calcium by double. It can also be good for like prevention of MS or rheumatoid arthritis, um, cancers. It's very hard to get too much of a vitamin just from food, but let's say you take something extra over and above your multivitamin, that's when you could run into trouble. If you're getting too much vitamin A, then that can be very damaging for your liver. Even calcium and vitamin C can be too much in high doses. Sure. If you're getting too much calcium or if you're getting too much vitamin C, then that can increase the risk of kidney stones. It's also common for people to take extra supplements of the vitamin B complex, but... And taking too much of vitamin B6 specifically can increase sensory neuropathy, which is sort of a tingling sensation that you would notice uh, in your limbs. So bottom line... And then if you're going to be taking anything more single supplement base, it's best to check with your doctor, dietitian, or pharmacist about whether those would be appropriate for you. For now, Foley is happy with just her multivitamin. I figure it can't hurt. It can't, and it probably will help. In Calgary, Leah Sarich, City News.